Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if copy and paste functionality is not working properly on your Windows device. So this should be a fairly quick tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu and we're going to have to identify what drive Windows is installed on. So we're going to type in this PC. It should be listed right above desktop app. We want to open that up. If you're running Windows 7 or Windows 8, you can just type in computer. If you're running Windows 7 or Windows 8, you can just type in computer to get to the same screen we're on right now. Underneath devices and drivers, there should be a local disk here with a little Windows icon above the hard drive. You want to take note of whatever letter is in here. Most people should be the C drive, C or D. Most people should just say C drive next to local disk. And then we're going to head back over to the start menu. You want to type in CMD. Best match should say command prompt right above desktop app. You want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control window, you want to select yes. Now I'm going to have this command in the description of the video. I want you just to type it in. I'm going to paste it in for simplicity's sake just to keep the video going a little bit. But basically just type in CMD and there's a space in here, forward slash and then whatever our letter is. So again, mine happens to be C. And then you have the little parentheses, the two little dashes, echo, and then another space, off. Then you have a straight line going up. I believe it should be underneath most people's backspace key. And then type the word clip. And then you do the end quotation marks, those two little dashes. And then you do another one of those straight lines. Again, should be underneath the backspace key on your keyboard. So I'm just copying it and pasting it. I know you guys will not be able to do that, but I figure it's just better that I explain exactly what it is. There's not too much to it. So you should be able to get that down pretty easily. And then you want to hit enter. If you typed it incorrectly, it should just move on to a blinking cursor. So let's say we typed it in incorrectly here and just typed in CMD echo or whatever. So it actually wasn't a great example here, but let's say I typed in CMD and some of that stuff or anything else, it should not give you anything back. So just want to put that out there, it should just be blank with a little cursor after it. So once you do that, I would recommend you restart your computer. If that does not resolve the issue, open back up the command prompt, and this time you want to type in SFC, all lowercase, space, forward slash, scan now. Scan now should be one word, and there should be two ends in here, so scan now attached to that little forward slash in front. And then you want to hit enter on your keyboard. It should begin running a system scan. It will take some time so just be patient, let it run. And then once that is done as well, I'd recommend you restart your computer and hopefully your issue has been resolved. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.